Hey guys, the beast is here. Under Swap, Santa's back. I will be making a Sans bobblehead mainly for myself, but don't worry, I'll make another unique custom bobblehead in Prepare Nation for sale. Maybe once my channel comes back from popularity. I went to my hometown's flea market and it had a lot of cheap stuff. One of which was these emoji bobbleheads that were worth two dollars each. Which I know it's probably a knockoff, but hey, cheap is cheap. It can be worth it just as long as it doesn't fall apart like sand. I even saw one unopened on the front desk. It's just that soothing to just watch them bobble for eternity. The one big worry I had while making this is my fear that I will screw it up and end up having it not bobble anymore. And as a bobblehead, that is very important. Anyways, let's begin with the process. Alright, we did. I did this. Everything's painted. I had the clay parts for the boots. And I think now, um... We should probably paint next. The white's fine, because the head's white. We're gonna do, like, the bottom. Or maybe we could do some whispering. Yeah, hold on. I'll figure it out. I'll be using this as a reference. This is what's from my, um... This is, uh, from a specific video. I'll link the video in the description. While, where I... Where I made, uh, the Emma Swap Sands as the back thing. It's not the main one, but... Yep, it still smells good. It smells like, uh... What does it smell like? Peppermint? Under Swap Sands. This is... What's it called? Okay, Under Swap's, um... I guess, uh, body waist? A thingamajig? Chesty thing is a set. I decide to um, glaze this part because I know this will easily chip away just by how much movement you use with it. Do with this. So next, I think I'm gonna do uh, the bottom part. All right. So I'm going to need to clean this up before um, I do anything else. Very. Thingy midget, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, so I just gotta clean this all up and then we will be on to the next step. Now, looky here, I did on the swap stance as a thingy. Of course, I'm not finishing it yet because I realized I should probably paint everything first and then glaze everything first and then finish up with the thing. Because I have to put in all the detail, I have to make sure every uh, paint won't be uh, scraping, I have to make sure um, that the wool isn't going to be like painted, or it's going to be sticky if I do the glaze. So yeah, that's my idea. Ta-da! Look, it's under some sands. I finished it. Now, hold on. I might actually do this as a two-parter, because I'm gonna be honest, I'm kind of drained a bit from things. So, this will probably be in a different, probably a sequel of, of this. But, there is actually something I want to surprise you guys about. Yep, we're actually going to make the box for Underson Sands. Yeah, it doesn't look the best, but I at least want to make some sort of box that would actually look good for him. It's not finished yet, but yeah, I cut out the plastic thing because it was just getting in the way, and just use the um, use some tape, probably tape again over it. But yeah, it's not done yet. Yep, I did the design. Um. I just did a bit of abstract because I didn't have no idea what I would have done with this. So I know it kind of looks a bit cheap, cheap, something like that, but um, I really don't have much strength wise.
when it comes to, um, I guess, drawing in a way. So, um, this is probably the final step. But, like, I'll be having to glaze this. And then, once glazed, everything's done for the underswap sands. Alright. This is what I got so far. Doesn't look the best, but that's okay. But, yeah. We're, we're actually done for the first part. I might just actually only... I might actually just put sands outside of the box. The reason why I even made a box is because... Well, I might actually have this be useful one day. Maybe some people will sign it? Who knows? So, I actually like it. It's, yeah, it's a little simple. But that's okay. Simple is cute. Now, this... This will be the next part. But I'm just letting you guys know. This uh, Underswap Sands thing is meant to be kept by me. I think about keeping it. Because I love Underswap Sands. And this, this is the one I'm going to be selling. Um, when I made it. So, yeah. This is just specifically for me. And let me show you this. This isn't mine. I mean, it is, but I didn't make it. I bought it off of Etsy. Etsy or, like, uh, eBay. Well, either way. Either way, um. I got this a few years ago. You know, it's I didn't made it, so that's why it doesn't look like. Uh, my own design. This looks more my own design. I kind of forgot that the blue should have been a bit darker. But that's okay. People will recognize it as dinosaur scenes either way. Or maybe it's the right color. I don't know. Yeah. I'm actually proud. So, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this, and I'll see you all next time. Bye!